State and True Basic Proportionality Theorem BPT also known as like Thales Theorem so here the statement is if a line is drawn parallel to one side of a triangle to intersect the other two sides in distinct points in two different points then the other two sides are divided in the same ratio see here in a triangle if a line is drawn parallel to one side if we we'll take the triangle ABC and if a line is drawn here DE which is parallel to BC then this DE divides AB and AC in the same ratio at D and E at two distinct points so we need to prove AD by DB equals AE by EC AE by EC so here given triangle ABC triangle ABC and DE is parallel to BC DE is parallel to BC now I need to prove see this DE divides AB and AC in the same ratio so I need to prove AD by DB equals AE by EC AD by DB equals AE by EC see to prove this the construction required here is the construction here two so first one see draw EF draw EF perpendicular to draw EF perpendicular to AB EF perpendicular to AB see if it is perpendicular to AB it will be perpendicular to AD or BD because the total is same line it's the same part next year and then join BE join BE one more the other part I'll do first after doing this half of the theorem here now see here now proof okay here we need to consider see we need AD by DB so I'll consider triangle consider area of triangle okay ADE ADE by area of triangle BDE area of triangle BDE so area of a triangle formula is here I'll write area of a triangle the formula is like half base into height half base into height so for ADE half base is AD and height is EF height is EF and for BDE for BDE half base is BD base is BD and height is EF some children they'll get doubt so in triangle BDE we don't have the height but see it is obtuse angle triangle for obtuse angle triangles we'll get height outside the triangle we'll get height outside the triangle here I'll show you see if it is a triangle if we'll take BC as a base this will be height if it is right angle triangle if we'll take BC as a base then you can consider AB as a height but if you we'll take obtuse angle triangle in obtuse angle triangle if you we'll take BC as a base then height will come like here outside of the triangle so in the same way here also see BDE BDE the it is an obtuse angle triangle so height is outside the triangle so height is EF here half and half cancel EF and EF cancel so you are left with AD by B D AD by B D so area of triangle A D E by area of triangle B D E is A D by B D this is equation 1 so this is equation 1 now second construction draw D G draw DG perpendicular to AC draw DG perpendicular to AC
C. D G perpendicular to A C and then join represent with dotted line so that to avoid the confusion join C D. Join C D or you can see this in another diagram. You can draw another diagram for this and you can see. And next one see here. Now consider area of triangle area of triangle from here you take a e d triangle a e d by area of triangle c e d that is half base for a e d i'll take this side right side base as a e if we'll take base as a e the height will be d g and half for c e d base i'll take c e height will be d g so half half cancel d g d g cancel you're left with a e by c e now here a e by c e area of triangle a e d by area of triangle c e d equals a e by c e so this is equation 2 now see if i'll say area of triangle a d e by b d e and area of triangle a e d by c e d if i'll prove these two are equal then see my theorem is done a d by d b is equal to a e by e c but for this to say these two are equal see numerators if you'll observe a d e a e d numerators are same now if you'll observe the denominators now see I'll write these two cases are equal because in denominators you see carefully here B D E B D E and here C E D C E D B D E D E and C E D this is also D E or E D these two triangles which are in the denominator they are on the same base they are on the same base and between the same parallel lines here on ninth class we have one theorem that is if suppose triangles two triangles now see these two triangles they are on the same base and between the same parallel lines then area of triangle ABC equals area of triangle DBC because they are on the same base BC and they are between the same parallel lines so if they are on the same base and between the same parallel lines they will be equal in area so in the same way here this two here I'll write area of triangle A D E by area of triangle B D E from one and two from one and two area of triangle A D E by area of triangle B D E equals area of triangle A E D by area of triangle C E D area of triangle C E D these two are equal see numerators are equal but denominators why they are equal we need to tell the reason because triangles okay triangles b d e and c e d are on the same base or on the same base d e B D E C E D. They are on the same base D E and between the same parallel lines. Same parallel lines. D E is parallel to B C. They are on the same base and between the same parallel lines. Therefore, these two are equal. Numerators are equal and area of triangle BDE okay triangles area of triangle BDE and area of triangle CED they are on the same base and between the same parallel lines so they are equal in area so here I can write AD by DB because this equation I got the value AD by DB and here I can write AE by EC because 
numerators once again i'll tell numerators anyhow they are same but why denominators are same because these two triangles they are on the same base de and they are between the same parallel lines therefore areas will be equal hence bpt is proved see a line drawn parallel to one side is dividing the other two sides in the same ratio ad by db equals ae by ec